Hey, I'm just controlling my PTZ Optics camera with an Xbox joystick controller. We've got lots of videos about that, but this video is going to be how to use an Android smartphone with PTZ control that also includes live video preview. Let me show you how to do it coming up next. Okay, so here's my Android phone and I'm gonna get two applications to do this. One is the Pan Tilt Zoom app. So I've already installed this. It's the Pan Tilt Zoom app um, and it's really, people really love it. It's a great application. Here it is here and you can use it to control your PTZ Optics cameras. This is in full screen mode. You've got a nice ability to Pan Tilt and Zoom have presets and then and control up to eight cameras here as you can see. So eight cameras, really nice. Uh, you've got your zoom in and out, your focus, which the focus is locked right now because a lot of times people just leave that in autofocus. And then you can also lock the pan um, so that you can't tilt, which is kind of nice. And uh, that's what that button there does. And then you hit the cog to get started here and it asks you to simply name your camera, which shows up on the preview. So we'll call this, we'll just call it cam one for, for demonstration purposes. And then enter the camera's IP address. Now you'll need to know your camera's IP address to do this. And then you have some options for preset uh, speeds and pan manual pan tilt and zoom speeds. So when you call a preset, you can have it go really slow on the pan and tilt modes uh, and the zoom. And then your manual control, which was that joystick button, you can choose to change those controls as well. So when we save that, you can see I've got two cameras here. I can switch back and forth. And you see that color light up when you know for sure that it's set. Now, uh, when, if I want to set a preset, I can set one and I can actually enter some information there, which is nice. So it doesn't have to just say one. It could say, you know, seat one. Uh, and then that way, you know, you can have a better, easier way of remembering what is where. Okay, so now we've got our PTZ control. It's pretty straightforward. I think you guys will be able to set that up pretty well. Now, the next thing we need is called VLC Media Player. And again, that can be found on the Google Play Store. This is completely free. The Pantelt Zoom app does cost $10. Um, and it goes to a really great cause. So VLC for Android here. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and open that. And in here, we're going to enter the information for the RTSP stream of the camera. So I'm going to type in RTSP. And let me just adjust my focus just a hair here so it's a little easier to see. There we go. RTSP colon slash slash 192.168.1.68. And then I'm going to hit a slash 2. Slash 1 is for the HD. Slash 2 is for the SD. I do not need the HD for this. There's our live video preview. Now, the trick here is to get this to uh, give us the ability to do the split screen. So to do split screen, we just touch this uh, icon button up here and click split screen. And so now we've got that at the top and then our other split screen will be our PTZ controller. So now we have the ability to control this. Now there's a little bit of latency with RTSP, but it's still a really nice option to have live video control and PTZ control, uh, you know, live video preview all in one here. So that's a great way to do it. This is the Pixel 2. I highly suggest getting the Pixel XL version or a tablet sized Android um, for this. This Pixel was only, Pixel 2 was only $120 refurbished, but definitely get the XL so there's a little bit more space for the controller and the presets. Okay, well that's it. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. There's a knowledge base article I'll link to below that you can follow to do this. It's pretty straightforward, a great way to have live video preview. By the way, these Android phones and Kindle devices can also be used for tally lights using a various video production software like vMix. So we'll make a video about that soon as well. 
awesome little hack for getting live video preview and remote pan tilt zoom camera control of your PTZ Optics cameras. Thanks for watching everybody. Join our Facebook user group at facebook.com slash group slash PTZ Optics Pals. There's a link below. You can join a lot of other folks using their PTZ Optics cameras in creative ways. Thank you for showing me how to do this. Pretty cool. Take care.